I started working on Pluckers Place and did that for a whole year. Right. And that was a great training ground as well because I really yeah. learnt more about live television, interviewing people, throwing to bands, back announcing, right. all the skills that you need when you're a presenter. So I learnt all of that, which was perfect because we kind of flew under the radar. So we got to have a bit of Could fun learn and muck and, around yeah. and make a few mistakes and, and peg it back. Yeah. And Daryl was obviously watching the whole time because it was one of his shows right. that his company was making. And so then I got asked to work. We used to call it the big show. I got asked oh, to work on the big show. Hey, yeah. Hey. And that was when it was pretty much at its peak. In the yes. 90s, you moved over to Hey Hey. And then I was all downhill and the reason it got axed. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> you joined at the peak no. and then it got axed. <laughs> but it was such a huge show. Just It's all mm -hmm. like every Australian just watched that. So that's where you came into pretty much everyone's onto everyone's radar really. Was that a real turning point for you? Would you walk down the street, people would know who you are? And uh, it was a gradual progression. Right. That recognition was quite gradual, which is good because I was very young, I was only 22. Yeah. So it is a lot to deal with. Totally. But the, I think the fact that I was so young helped me because I didn't understand the history of the show. Yep. The so way it didn't that intimidate a lot of other you. people did. Yeah, yeah. To me, it was a show that I, you know, I'd, I'd watched every week and it was yep. great, but I didn't know it had been on for 40 years before that. Yeah. It, you know, you think that life doesn't exist before you're born. No, it doesn't, so, as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> so in that terms, it, I almost had this sort of little bubble around me, yeah. which was great because it meant that I could be confident to say what I was thinking and, yeah, right. and jump in and join in on things. I wasn't intimidated by it all. So Perfect. it was almost like being oblivious to the history of it actually worked in my favour. Yeah, right.